that sad update on the search for a missing seven-year-old girl in Texas. Authorities say she was abducted and killed, and a FedEx contract driver is now in custody. ABC's Rena Roy is joining us with the latest on these developments. Rena, good morning to you. Eva, good morning to you. Just a terrible turn of events. Hundreds of volunteers, dogs and drones were all out there with investigators. But unfortunately, by the time they found her, she was gone after police say she was snatched just feet away from her home. Overnight, a more than 48 hour search coming to a horrific end. The body of seven year old Athena Strand found after police say she was abducted and killed. Yes. One of the toughest investigations that I've been involved in um, because it's a child. <clears throat> and any time there's a child that dies, it just hits you in your heart. 31-year-old Tanner Lynn Horner is now in custody and will be charged with capital murder and aggravated kidnapping. We do have a confession. Police say Horner was delivering a package to Strand's house Wednesday evening and snatched her from the driveway soon after, just 200 yards from the home. Authorities believe that Strand died within an hour of being abducted. The most critical time when a child disappears is the first three hours. And the place you immediately look at was who was out in the community, people delivering things. Uh, people having calls for their home air conditioning and heater to be fixed, whomever it might be. But the key is they can be your eyes and ears as to who might be on the street at the time this child disappeared. The first grader was reported missing from her father's home in Paradise, Texas that same evening. Strand's stepmother calling 911 saying she had gotten into an argument with Athena, went to make dinner, then found Athena's bedroom empty, telling police she searched for an hour but found no sign of the young girl. Police issuing an Amber Alert on Thursday, hundreds of volunteers helping in the search efforts. We spoke with her family on Friday. We definitely don't believe Athena ran off. We're not sure if she's been abducted or not. I'm scared and I'm hoping that we find her. Investigators locating her body late Friday. And FedEx telling ABC News that words cannot describe their shock at the reports surrounding this tragic event. Uh, guys, just such a terrible story. Really a parent's worst nightmare. Rena, thank you for that update. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.